Hi there YouTube, how you doing? Today we're gonna install, um, at least we're gonna try to install Android 6 x86 Marshmallow on a little tablet. And Okay, to do such a thing on a tablet, you will need a USB stick, a USB hub, you will need an external keyboard, and that's it in fact. So we can start with creating the bootable USB stick, and we will do that on a Mac or in Windows with unit booting. Today we're gonna install Android 6 Marshmallow onto a tablet, a x86 tablet that is running Windows 10 at this moment. We are in my Mac and I'm first gonna clean up the USB stick but if you are in Windows you just format the drive that's what I'm doing here and it's FAT32 formatted so yeah it's all good. Okay we're gonna boot up unit boot in it's the same uh, as for Windows, here you can see my USB stick is found and we're just gonna go ahead and look for the Android that is on my desktop. Oh la la, lots of files. Dang, let me look for it. Let me look it up. ISO, so, boop, there it is, done. All right, so we just hit OK and now the USB stick will be created. If this is done, this process, then you will be able to boot up uh, straight from USB with a tablet, but also with a laptop or a computer that supports booting from USB. Okay, welcome back. This is the tablet. It's the feedback 10 and we're gonna see how we're gonna do that. Well, first we're gonna kill the system. It's running Windows 10 as you can see. It's the educational, but I have a license for it, a serial, a key. So, you know, I can install it whenever I want. So, uh, what we're now gonna do is insert the USB stick, okay? And uh, we're gonna hit F10, F11 or F12. So we can boot from the USB stick and there we go. We're just gonna scroll down to install Android on, uh, on the tablet. So there we go, uh, we're running the installer until we get in another screen. Up there we can hit enter. Make sure that your drive is, you know, um, Linux formatted so you have a Linux partition up there I already created that with gparted um, and up here we just gonna just check the steps that I'm doing there for EVI we will not select anything because we don't have EVI in the system um, here we're gonna select yes read write and now the system will be installed and after this is done we will be able to boot the tablet. Dang, the screen is flashing, boom, wow, look at that, looks nice, I'm kind of a little bit, uh, hey, yeah, the touch is working, fantastic, Wi-Fi stations are working, we're gonna skip that for now, well, I'm just gonna go through these little settings, so let's see what they all are, let's go pass it, ah, okay, yeah. okay. I got it, I got it, I got it my friend. The touch is working really nice, peeps. 
And you see how good this tablet is? Ha, you talk about tablets. You see the screen is still green, just like we know, but from 4.3, but this looks fantastic. As you can see, the Google Play Store is installed. So um, it's all there. So let's go into the settings, yo. Because it's all, you see the settings look kind of like Android 5 about the tablet. Unfortunately, settings has been stopped, okay? But we can see it. Um, I'm not even sure if you can read it. Can you read it there? Android 6, VPAD 10, ViewSonic, November 1, 2015, Baseband Unknown, OpenGL driver version, build number, Android x86, user debug 6, MD, ooh, I can't read that, so good, MDB08M, Ng Xiu Yuang, that's, you know, the king, what I was talking about, 2015-11-26, so this is kind of new, you know, this is kind of new, this is fresh from the press, and I'm probably the first one uh, showing it, uh, of course, thanks to uh, Mr. Wang, and thank you very much, uh, Mr. Wang, for this uh, beautiful version, I was already searching for it last week, uh, and uh, today, it was there, I was thinking of it, and then boom, I went searching and I found it you know so thank you very much once again uh, mr. Wang and uh, yes watchers people uh, I hope you liked uh, this video because I think it is really nice fantastic in fact we installed Android peeps it's running and up peeps if this video was kind of useful on this uh, late night evening please like subscribe and let me know in the comments what you think of this project.